In the spare time, when I'm not working for HCL Technologies, I like to browse through the BVA auction website and uh, find some cars that I would like to buy and resell later on. Major disadvantages of this website is that it lacks good search capabilities. It is quite difficult to find the right car in the right category with the correct price and uh, mileage or age. To overcome those disadvantages, I've decided to build an RPA solution that retrieves the data from the website, stores it into an Excel file, makes it more uh, browsable and uh, searchable, and enriches the data with additional data from another website mark plot. So let's see it in action. In the first part of the video, the robot is going to the website and it retrieves all the links that are available in the auto category. It will use the pagination to figure out if there are more pages and uh, browse to each and every page and get all the links that are available. As you can see, all the 263 links have been retrieved and saved in an Excel file. The second part of the video takes the most time, since the robot now needs to go to each link and retrieve the information which is available on that particular page. To increase that process, I have decided to decrease the number of links to visit, and I have also speeded up the video four times. Now that the data is enriched and we have retrieved all the necessary categories, it's time to perform the last step. During this step, additional data is retrieved from the website called Markplot. The additional data is the average price for the car. This process has two major branches. Cars that do have mileage and license plate information number available will be performed through one process and cars that do not have that information will be performed by another branch. Retrieving the data for cars with the license plate and mileage information is much easier than for others without this, this information. So for that, we're gonna browse to a special website where we can just type in the number plate or the license plate and the mileage. And it will get the average price for that car uh, at a particular time. However, for the cars that do not have such an information, the process is a bit different. By browsing through to the Markplatz website, we can find uh, similar cars and retrieve the average price for those cars. By the end of this process, we have an Excel file that contains all the information about the cars that are for sale on the BVA auction website. So the only thing that needs to be done is make the right decision and place a bid.